Hey, what's up everybody? It's Richie here, and today I have a pretty cool glitch for you guys. A glitch that will allow basically any item capable of falling to float. Now the way this works is pretty simple. Basically, you place down double tall grass two blocks under the block you want to float, and then you place the floating block off of another block onto the top of the double tall grass. If you place it directly on it, well, it will just fall. But if you place it above, it will float right there. And of course, we don't have to keep this there. If we punch out this bottom block right here, this block will actually stay floating. And that's because when we break this block, it updates the block above it, but not this block right here. So we can break this, and we now have a floating block. Now, it's not going to stay there forever if you update it by putting string on it, placing any block on it, or activating it in any way with redstone, it's just gonna fall right back down. But for now, it is floating, which leads to some very interesting situations and some very interesting things you can do with it. And when I say you can do interesting things, I mostly mean you can prank your buddies. What I've done right here is place string on top of these blocks, and whenever someone steps on string, it updates the blocks. It doesn't have to be hooked up to anything. So if we have one piece of string and we walk onto here, then everything will fall. It could fall a few harmless blocks, or it could fall into a bottomless pit. And I have to say, gravel roads are very, very common. So if you wanted to prank or trap someone, this is a pretty good way to do it. You can also use this glitch to make the famous TNT cake trap. And basically what's happening here is we have this floating block right here, and this cake on top of it. Now when you eat this cake, it updates the block, and it falls, completing a circuit, and setting off TNT. So if we eat this cake right here, it's not gonna be too good for us. And if you're a builder and you wanna use this for a slightly better purpose, not only does floating sand aesthetically look cool, but it also drops these cool little dust particles that can be like a really good touch in an attic or some sort of a similar build. And for those of you who don't know how to get double tall grass, all you have to do is bone meal regular grass and then cut it with shears and you will have it. But unfortunately, guys, that's just about all the time I have for today. I know it was a fast video, but I find this glitch really, really fun and really useful. And I'm curious to see what you guys use it for. If you do use it and you find a better use for it, then tell me down in the comments. And while you're there, leave a like on this video and subscribe if you haven't already. And just thank you so much, guys. This channel is growing like crazy. I'm having a ton of fun making videos and it's pretty awesome. But anyway, this has been Richie, and I will see you next time.